Tired of dealing with annoying flies, fruit flies, and gnats in your home? The Zevo Flying Insect Trap is your ultimate solution. Don't wait. Check out the link in the video description now to get your Zevo Flying Insect Trap on Amazon and enjoy a bug-free home today. A police officer has been cleared of killing a lecturer's son with his patrol car after the judge ruled it as a tragic accident. PC Christopher Corker, 40, was alleged to have knocked down and killed 27-year-old Arthur Halsher Ermert in Peacehaven, East Sussex. Mr. Halsher Ermert was struck by the vehicle just after 11.10 p.m. on April 30, 2022, and was tragically confirmed dead at the scene. The incident had been caught on graphic video footage shown in court at an earlier hearing. Corker, of Worthing, West Sussex, had pleaded not guilty to causing death by dangerous driving and causing death by careless or inconsiderate driving. On Monday the Sussex police officer, who was on unconditional bail, attended the Old Bailey for what was scheduled to be the first day of his trial. However, Prosecutor Jonathan Sandiford K.C. offered no evidence at a hearing before Judge Richard Marks K.C., saying that in light of expert reports there was no longer a realistic prospect of a conviction. Members of Mr. Halsher-Ermert's family sat in court for the short hearing. Judge Marks formally entered not guilty verdicts and offered his condolences to the family, saying, it appears to have been a tragic accident. As the officer left court, one of those in court told him, you are still responsible for killing Arthur. Never forget his name. Never. Dirty B asterisk 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 D. In a statement after the hearing, the family said, instead of attending trial today, we as a family have had to process the sudden news that the CPS are discontinuing criminal proceedings against PC Corker. This is incredibly upsetting and disappointing. It has been over two years since Arthur died. We were hoping to start to get answers about what happened to Arthur and why on April 30, 2022. We are shocked to now find out that PC Corker isn't going to be held criminally accountable for what he has done. Our fight for the truth and accountability goes on. We now look ahead towards Arthur's inquest. 